The Youth 20 Conclave under the aegis of the G20 Summit is underway in Kuhati. Today, the Youth 20 Conclave entered its third and final day, even as more than 150 representatives from across the world and about 12,000 students from 36 universities in India are participating. Union Sports Minister Anurag Tagur attended today's session. The Y20 inception meeting is being held by the Youth Affairs and Sports Ministry. The conclave is deliberating on the betterment of youth in various ways. Issues like climate change, disaster management, peace building and the role of youth in governance and health sector are being deliberated upon. And meanwhile, Union Sports Minister Anurag Thakur addressed the concluding session of the Y20 Summit. G20 ke engagement groups bane hai. Usme Youth 20 ka ek apna mahatv hai kyunki dunia ki sabse badi yuva abadi Bharat mein hai. Lekin Y20 inception meeting yani ke Youth 20 ki jo pehli meeting hui hai wo desh mein Assam ke Guwahati mein hua hai. और ये केवल इंसेप्शन मीटिंग तक इसको सीमित नहीं रखा गया इसको आसाम के हर जिले तक हर कॉलेज तक ले जाने का प्रयास किया गया है दस हजार से ज्यादा स्टूडेंट्स ने 36 कॉलेजेस आसाम में पार्टिसिपेट किया जहां पांच टॉपिक्स इन सभी युवाओं को दिए गए तो और कुल मिलाकर इन युवाओं ने उस एरिया के आसपास के जो 10-10 स्कूलों में जाकर बच्चों तक स्कूल के स्टूडेंट्स तक G20 और Y20 के बारे में बताने का काम भी जागरूकता अवेयरनेस का काम किया। They have reached out to 10 lakh students in and around 4,000 schools through the quiz competitions organized in these schools on Y20। इसी तरह से सेमिनार डिबेट जो कॉलेजेस में हुए उसमें 10000 से ज्यादा युवाओं ने भाग लिया और उनमें से बहुत सारे युवाओं को चुनकर इस मीटिंग में भी आने का अवसर मिला सो so, 21 फॉरेन डेलीगेट्स एंड 200 इंडियन डेलीगेट्स फ्रॉम वेरियस पार्ट्स ऑफ द कंट्री पार्टिसिपेटेड इन दिस इवेंट नो वेयर इन द वर्ल्ड पीपल्स पार्टिसिपेशन वाज मेड टू दिस लेवल इंडिया हैज टेकन इट टू द ग्रास रूट लेवल so that is the key behind every program of Prime Minister and that is why Sabka Saath, Sabka Vikas, that is the theme of the government. And here also, every stakeholder has been involved in this by taking their views, their opinions and how we can achieve that, the roadmap for the next 20, 30 years, 40 years, 50 years and what the world should look like and what could be the contribution of the youth. And this is the difference that in the just for first 15 20 days if we have already involved 10000 youth from the colleges and universities from one state you could imagine by the end of the y20 presidency in india there will be millions of youth who will participate in the y20 talks and they will know about the importance of g20 and also know how big and how successful was G20 in India by the end of this year.